Ramakrishna Mission Students Home in Tamil Nadu, India. The charitable institute provides education and shelter to over 650 children. Some orphaned and others from poor families. The community kitchen also cooks an impressive 3,000 meals every day. With fuel prices skyrocketing, the institute was finding it tough to make ends meet. So we found it very difficult. Then we started uh, using a uh, wood gas stove for some time. Then, as a permanent measure, we thought of going for solar systems. Support came from a UNDP and Government of India initiative financed by the Global Environment Facility. Fossil fuels and LPG were replaced with an innovative technology that harnesses solar energy. The concentrator dish system called Arun 100 is designed to capture maximum heat from the sun and channel it to the kitchen, even storing heat for cooking the next day. We store the steam in an accumulator. It is stored up to 670 degrees and 7 bar pressure. Then, whenever we want to cook, we take that steam from the accumulator. But we use 1 bar pressure for cooking. So we cook, mainly we cook rice, dal, vegetables, milk through this solar steam cooking system. Using solar energy has half the institution's fuel bill resulting in a saving of about $8,000 every year. Clearly a win-win situation. The project really showcased how uh, innovative solar technologies can contribute uh, to India's energy demands. In addition, over the next three years, uh, 45,000 square meters of concentrated solar technologies will be installed, which will significantly reduce also uh, carbon emissions. Um, this is a small beginning. But given India's huge potential, we see that this project will have endless opportunities. Music